And I'm on your team still, living. What's up, you guys? Welcome back to the show. Call of Duty Ghosts, I know. You what? Oh, man. Jeez. Yeah, you're right. It's happening again. Um, so thank you guys so much for all the support on the other videos. Um, um, Ultimate Team and all that stuff. And the um, My Player and MLB 14 Road to the Show. All that cool stuff. You guys have been awesome. Um, first, I want to wish everyone a happy 4th of July. Happy Independence Day. Um, God bless America. This is one of the best countries in the world. Uh, I've, I've kind of made videos like this um, for the last couple of years, and I figured I'd make another one. Um, and uh, I, I kind of want to say what, what I love about this country and stuff like that. But before I do that, I want to say, um, first, great showing by the United States. Amazing. I'm proud to say that um, I support that team, and they did a great... They, they, they really represent our country with, with, with a lot of class. Um, and when, when you look at other teams... You know who who have been accused of flopping, who have been accused of biting, who have been accused of, to to in in uh, brawling and, and all these other just just terrible, terrible storylines. You don't see that from from the United States, you know, and um and, and that's really uh you know great to see and 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 it's, and it's amazing um the the amount of support back home in in the United States that they had that the viewing parties were, were were crazy cool. Um, Chicago, I can say, was absolutely amazing. So, yes, that is that. But, as I said, let me set up this gameplay. So, Call of Duty Ghosts on 360. And I know that a lot of people are like, Yo, Call of Duty Ghosts, what the hell? Calm down. Um, yes, I do still play the 360, oh you guys. Um, I, I know a lot of people have been, you know, wondering that. I do still play it. I really only play it for Call of Duty Ghosts, though. Um, and really, it's just because, you know, a lot of my friends still are. How is he going to get that knife off, though? A lot of my friends still are on... Um, uh, still do play Call of Duty Ghost, so when they hit me up in the text and like, "Yo, bro, like, come on, let, let's let's jump on and play," I'm like, "All right, cool," you know. So if you guys are interested in in, 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 if, in in still playing with me on on NBA or MLB or Ghost, even just hit me up on Twitter on whatever, um, and just say, "Hey, yo, living man, uh, jump on. I'm I'm playing this, uh, and if I'm free, I'll jump on." You know, I'm not on this that much again because I'm kind of hooked to the PS4. So you know, what can I say? But that is that. At the beginning, that one clip. Oh my gosh. Okay. So we're in this game, right? Uh, me and one more toy, who's a guy that I've known for years. And there's this kid that comes into this game and he is absolutely obsessed with us. And um, it, it's like the craziest thing because I'm like, I, I, I don't really want to talk to him, but I'm, I'm, I'm a nice person. You know, I mean, mama ain't raised no fool and mama ain't raised no douchebag. So. I am a nice person. I talk to him and stuff like that. Now, one more toy. He's very opinionated, I guess you could say. So he mutes this kid like five minutes in. So he doesn't know that I'm still talking to him. And that's kind of what the exchange was before. You know, I mean, the kid's happy to be on, on, on our team. He's talking to me. And then one more toy is like, yo, he's still talking to that kid? Like, but whatever. Okay. So now that's all the way. And kind of know this gameplay is. Let me talk about. The, um, the the United States and yes you guys I know you guys can can, can can rag on me and you guys can say yo bro like really you gonna dedicate a whole video to the United States of America and I'm gonna say yes yes I am so without further ado let me talk about the United States of America now I'm I'm not boasting and a lot of people may get mad at me and, 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 and kind of not understand really where I'm coming from. Um, but I have, I have, this this is a 10 minute video, 10, 10 plus minute video. And um, I do this every year. And the message is kind of the same, but kind of different every year as well. So let me first say this. I am guilty of taking um, uh, for granted some of the amenities that other people don't have. And the fact that I can stop this video, go out, grab some Subway, ooh, Subway. <laughs> um, as I get a flipping sack comment in the care pack, it's like, what the fuck? But literally, I can go out and I can grab some food and I can come back. And I don't, that like, food is not a worry. And, and electricity is not a worry. And, and clean water is not a worry for me. And sleeping someplace safe and knowing that that I'll I'll wake up the next morning not living in fear of of, 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 of guns and bombs and, 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 and all this other stuff. I don't have to do that. Like I don't live with that type of fear. And 
the fact that I have that um that that that, that privilege I think like I said I'm guilty of kind of um, not appreciating it as much as I probably should and this is going to sound really bad but I feel like a lot of Americans don't really appreciate that you know um and uh, I I also think that for as good as America is there are a lot of faults in America all right but I think that one of the biggest misconceptions um, that people from from other countries who look at America have this opinion on is, you know, obviously they're gonna say, oh, those fat, selfish, you know, uh, um, only think of numero uno type of people over there at in, in the United States. And yes, there are a lot of people who live here who who are selfish and who just think and about numero uno, who don't think about their fellow man and stuff like that. Um, but, I don't know, maybe I'm ignorant to the fact, but I truly believe that, you know, more than you think actually do care about their fellow countrymen or countrywoman and um, would help people in need, you know, and... And with, without the cameras rolling, you know, and hey, I may get some flack for this, but I'm sorry. Yes, you want to inspire people and you want to do good things. And you, but, you know, good things happen all the time. Whether it's helping somebody with their bags or helping some old, old lady cross the street or, or letting somebody cut into your lane because they're late for work and you see them trying to get to work on time or, or, or giving a server a bigger tip after they've been yelled at or, or, you know, j just calling a, 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 a helpline and not yelling at them into, like, totally out of control, knowing that they've been yelled at for for the last 10 hours, you know? Or giving up your seat on, on, on a bus or a train or whatever. Like, these little insignificant things, I think, a lot of people do for their fellow countrymen. And... You know, yes, it's not recorded, it's not posted on YouTube for a billion views and all this other stuff, you know, and, 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 and they're not getting, like, a ton of money from it and stuff. But but I truly do believe that a lot of people in our country do care about about other people and, and, and aren't selfish and, and aren't, like, egotistical. Um, you know, are we responsible for that image that we put out there? Possibly, I mean, you look at what what foreigners have to judge us on. It's really just like you know, um, you know, keeping up with the Kardashians and and this and that. And it's like that's really the image they were putting out there. Is like you know the, the these teen mom hillbilly people getting pregnant at sixteen and getting all this money from it, you know, or people not working hard and getting fame like that, you know. So when you look when when people look at that. That's the that's the image that we're portraying. But I but I but I challenge people to look deeper than that. To look to, to, to really get to know this country because once you get to know this country and you really get to know the people of this country, you'll realize that we're not all selfish, egotistical pricks. We really do care about everyone else. I I, I truly do believe that. And um yes, have we lost our way a couple times? Oh sure. You know, who hasn't? <laughs> but um, we're good. We're good people, and we really do love our country. And you know, it's it's yes. On this Independence Day, um, by the way, watch the movie because it's awesome. I I watch it every year. <laughs> On this Independence Day, I want to end my little rant and my little speech and all this stuff by saying. I would not change one thing in my life. Yeah. I am proud to be an American. I'm, 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 I'm proud to have the freedoms that I have. And um, I would not change anything in the world. Any other criticism that comes my way, hey, you know what? Bring it on. I'm, 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 I'm happy Independence Day to everyone out there. And also, um, if, you're, if you're not from the United States... No, try to think well. about okay. what your image of uh, what your image is of the United States 
and try to think no, about how you got that image is. and if it's really a no. justified image. And also, I challenge you to think about your own country. You know, try to think about what people think of you, what the what are those stereotypes people think of of your country and how pissed off it makes you when you know hey that's not true we're not like that you know so that's it as this game wraps up you guys i actually had a pretty good game for america <laughs> actually I, had, I actually had a pretty good game so that's kind of cool to do um i don't really have games like this very often so that's one reason why i put this up here but thank you guys so much for watching leave comments down below let let us let, let me know what your favorite part of america is um congratulations to the u.s national team we didn't make it that we didn't make it past the next round, but we had a great showing. Um, and also, if you're not from America, what do you like? What's one thing that you love about your country? Uh, yes, that's it. Living five and zero again. Happy Independence Day. I'm out.